Hey everyone, it's Brandy and welcome back to my channel, Brandy Janae's Bookshelf. Today I am here to show you guys my February Outcrate box. Um, I know I go back and forth with doing unboxings on my channel. Depends usually on when I get my box. Usually if I get them earlier like I did this time around, I will post an unboxing because I feel like most people haven't posted stuff yet or this is around a time where everyone is posting their unboxings. But when I get them later in the month or later than most people get there. So I decided not to put it up because it's like I've seen so many unboxings. I feel like no one wants to see another one. And these are usually my least viewed videos anyway. So I will continue to do that based on how I feel when I get my box and things like that. But if you guys are looking for me to do unboxings, let me know down in the comments and then I will make sure to do them every month. But if not, I will just continue to do them based on, like I said, how I feel and when I get my box. This is the February 2019 Outcrate box. I got this this past weekend and I kind of wanted to film on the weekend, but my weekend was pretty packed up. I'm filming on Monday and today's my mom's birthday. And over the weekend she celebrated, we went to painting with the twist. And I wasn't going to show you guys my painting, but I kind of want to show it off because I feel like I'm not going to show it off any other times so i'm actually gonna go get that so i can show you guys so basically my mom picked a picture and we had an instructor walk us through step by step on how to you know create the painting on our own for those who don't know what like painting with the twist or those type of things are and this is what i did actually on camera it doesn't look too bad in person i guess because i saw it step by step so i was just like I don't like it or it's not that I don't like it it's just certain things that I wish I had done differently or did not do at all but looking at it on camera it does not look too bad so um yeah that's what I did this past weekend so like I said I got this on Saturday I got it right before I was leaving out the house to before going to the painting with the twist I was a little impatient as always I haven't seen any actual unboxings but I did open it up and I saw the item that was right on top because I did take out the spoiler card and like look at the items on the spoiler card but I didn't like take anything out and look at anything so here is the card for this box and the theme for February was whimsical beast and that's what the back looks like it you know has everything that's in there really like the artwork um Let's just get into it. So the first thing is this beanie. I'm going to take it out of the bag. So like I mentioned, we have this beanie, this winter beanie that is Harry Potter themed. As you can probably see, it says Accio Books. Moving on to the next big item, which is also Harry Potter themed. We have this travel umbrella, which is what it's called according to the spoiler card. So if you look on here, um, I will open it up so you guys can see. Hopefully you can see the design better. But I love the fact, I think I mentioned this a little bit ago, but I'll create like logos, uh, labels everything with their logo so you know where it came from. I'm not sure how well you guys can see that. I'm not sure if like how much of the design is picking up. But um, here I can kind of see this little section somewhat from the other side but I see the fluffy the three-headed dog I see Buckbeak in Hagrid's hut and uh, there's a unicorn there and um, like there's a bunch of different magical creatures that I'm guessing are from different parts of the book um, I don't know if you guys can see that here on the top uh, like right here we have the centaurs carrying off Umbridge. I remember that scene from the movie. It took me a little too long to get that all folded back up and put back into like the case. But this is really cute and it's always nice to have an umbrella handy. I'm not sure how well it showed off. Actually, maybe I can show you on here since I'm not sure if it actually showed up. Um, It's trying to focus on my face. So I'm not sure how well it's picking that up. You see there's Umbridge and the centaurs. Um, there is an ogre. I know there is like a phoenix. So moving on to the next item, we have this soap 
from Lilo Soap and it says crystal or I'm sorry it says pixie dust crystal soap and this is really cute I really love like the color uh yeah I think it picks up way brighter than it looks in person but it's really pretty it also has glitter in it if you have not seen my Wicked King unboxing that came from Alcray. We actually also got like a gem type soap in that box from the same company. So I'm hoping that I enjoy this because then I'll have two. The next thing that's in here is a keychain that was designed by Four Seasons Fox. And it says it's a Haku Dragon keychain. Oh geez, I'm not, my light is probably making it where you can't even make it out. Um, hopefully you can see the design on there. My light's not too bright for that, for you to pick that up. But, uh, yeah, I don't know, um, the card says that this is from Spirited Away. Next, I have the monthly enamel pen and this month's pen was designed by Ink and Wonder and it says official phoenix writer club so once again hopefully you can see that there we go it finally focused uh hopefully you can see that good enough with the light that i have on right now so getting into the book or books i should say it looks like we have two books in this month's box the first one that i'm seeing is the tea dragon society oh i don't know how well that's going to show up because it is white <laughs> um but yes this is a graphic novel and i believe or maybe it's just a comic i'm not exactly sure it might just be a comic um i have seen this one floating around booktube a lot of people have been talking about this and i've been really interested in picking it up but it's just something that i haven't went out to purchase yet i was thinking, contemplating picking it up like this month or something but i'm glad i didn't because now i have a copy obviously it's not the hardcover copy but that's fine this copy is exclusive to the owl crate box and i'm really looking forward to this i have seen people show this off the art style is really cute so the book for this month's box is crown of feathers by nikki pal petro i'm probably butchering that last name but this is an Alcrate exclusive cover. They changed the coloring, I believe. It looks like they went for an overall darker scheme. I I don't know. I like both of the covers. I like the fact that they did dark enough the background, but I also know that I do like I did like the gold, the golden yellow that was on the original cover. But then like we kind of have a little bit of that in the back and it looks like more flame like sunsetty flames and it's really pretty and we also have these purple sprayed edges it's all the same color <laughs> um but i i don't know i really like this that is also signed by the author and as always we have a letter from the author and it actually has the map on the back it also came with this feather bookmark which also matches the color scheme of the one that we have like the book cover that we have as always we have the booklet in there which obviously has the same artwork as the information card and opening right up we have an interview with the author as well as the differences between the normal cover and the outcrate cover or at least the front cover and as always we have like a word search with some book recommendations we also have interview with one of the illustrators from this box we have uh photo challenges and theme for next month which has already been announced it has already been announced on instagram but i will still show off the little card that we get so here's the information card for next month the theme for the march box is murder and mayhem yeah murder and mayhem and that's what that looks like and it says in that box we will receive an exclusive travel mug from Katrina Book Designs. So that's really nice and that is what the design on the back of that looks like. All of this white in here is kind of throwing off my camera because of this bright light I have on but there we go that kind of focused a little bit well that was everything that came in the february outcrate box if you got this box let me know what your favorite item was thank you guys so much for watching if you liked it give it a thumbs up if you would like to see more from me make sure you subscribe and i will see you guys again in the next one bye